Hello everybody, I'm Dehane from the Hammer Game Channel, welcome back to a new video and back to Kaiser Redux for today. We're going to be playing as the AOG, the German puppet in China with, oh my days, what is, Falkenhausen, is that his name? I just completely forgot what his name is. The guy that's usually in the vanilla game, you know, you withdraw from China or you can let him stay and they get him as a general. Anyways, let's get cracking, shall we? This should be fun, but it's probably going to be very tough as well. Oh, so Xing Tao is our capital. We do have little holdings all across uh, China. And we are going to expand and become China. We're going to have German China. At least we're going to try. Might take multiple attempts because I'm a noob. So we do get a lovely little focus tree. We can't start doing this one until we get the Black Monday Crisis. Okay, so we're going to be gaining collapsed economy. I just waited to see what industrial advancements was doing. It wasn't doing a lot, but yay, we have collapsed economy. Also notice territorial concessions, minus 35% of global population. That's fantastic, isn't it? That's 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 just great. Alexander von Falkenhausen around. We are going to bail out the major companies filing for bankruptcy. We're going to bail them out. Otherwise, if you don't bail them out, you get good. Yes, the government bail out of major companies... And the main, the head office has been <laughs> burnt down. Ah, great, we just lost a handful of our territories there. That's fantastic. That's that's really, really good. Uh, Colonel of Storm Moscow. Um, we're going to see if we can get Yang Zhao back. If not, we will be invading you and defeating you. I can declare one left. I'm going to risk it here, guys. And I am going to take what is ours. I'm, I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna do that. I'm not losing factories. I think I'm going to do the AOG reform. It's gonna pee off the Germans a little bit, but I want that political power. Do you know what? I'm gonna help the Nanjing clique here. Why else do I wait for ships to be built? I'm coming in to help. Give me military access, my friend. Well, I just took uh, Longyang, which is uh, the capital city for the left Kuomintang. So that's a nice victory for us there. Take it, please, and that should be victory. Yeah, there we go. Uh, do they control any of my land? Yes, that's coming back to me. We have one whole ship, guys, which means I can get naval superiority to do a naval invasion of this province. It does look like they actually have more divisions now, which is a bit concerning, but um, hopefully I can get a wee foothold on things. We're off to China. It does look like they're defending, but it'll be okay. Just in case they somehow attempt to naval invade me back, let's just do that. Let's do that. Hopefully. That's 51%. Guess what we can do? We can puppet them. Ah, perfect. The Nanjing clique just finished taking out uh, Anqing, which is perfect because they are about to become my my puppets. Which is going to be great because then I can use their divisions to destroy my enemies in the south here. Well, we're off to a good start using uh, divisions here. We've uh, circled a nice wee handful of them. Yang Zhao is back under our rightful control. Try and see if we can encircle the remainder of their divisions. Yeah, that was a good move by us. We have just encircled a decent amount of them. How many divisions have they got left? 5 of 17. We've probably got at least 5 in there. My actual divisions have even got across as well now. Um, head to Nanning. Oh, boom goes the dynamite. Oh, yes. Oh, abandoned reforms that we have made enough progress with the compromise. We met our goals. Yeah, we'll keep that. We've, we've made it to our goals. Let's just finish there. Alright, I see. Oh, I could intervene in the League War. An agreement with the Qing. Okay. Interesting. We can attack Hanan. Hello there, Hanan. You're not looking too strong. Oh, it is beautiful. Oh, AOG is hella thick, boy. I'm not going to declare war on Ching. That would be stupid. Um, let's get a research law. After the Hanan clique we go. Don't quite know what they're doing. But where are all their divisions? I'm just going to walk around everybody. Well, that's game, set, match any second now. Yep, happy days. Nice. Do I actually get any cores on this? Nope, no, I do not. Holy hell. France actually done the Day of Infamy. 
I think this is a very ballsy move, but I'm wanting to get this war over with sooner rather than later. So we are are pushing into some of this territory. I think that'll do. If we can get them to the river, I will be present, pretty happy. Well, some, somehow we're we're still holding. Uh, we have killed 99,000. We lost 21,000 just because they've pushed us back a little bit. We're back beyond the river. I probably should have just defended here in the first place. Hey, yes, it's time for the failure of the Halifax Conference. That's going to be coming. Uh, we're actually kind of pushing out over here. Okay, I may be a bit off more I could chew. To be honest, that actually hasn't been a terrible thing to do. Look how many divisions they've pulled out to cover that. Quite a lot. You were not supposed to leave there. Other sons of Queen's they will have... Take no territory in France or Great Britain and allow both to return home! Holy Yes, that is what we were needing. That's going to help us out drastically. They'll move a lot of troops in a second. Ah, oh, yep, uh, Ching is kind of dying big time now. This is when we probably should have declared war on them, but I didn't know when it was actually going to fire. We have done a big bit of damage to them, though, and we should actually be able to maybe push over and circle some of them now. Well, here's the first encirclement. It's of four divisions, which is pretty good. I'm happy with that. Oh, Ching managed to defeat one of us, but they're very close to dying. Um, yeah, we're also at war with Russia now. Boom, baby. Boom. Ah, they are going to be so much easier to deal with now. Um, I wasn't a complete... Oh, and a current... That's fine. Um, we will be able to do that. I wasn't a complete dick to them. I took what I needed to take and I gave them a couple of bits of land. I love how they have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven divisions engaging three right now. Oh, I don't get a choice with a single currency. Ah, oh, it's fine. I'll, I'll take it. Ah, they're dead. Finally. Oh, it is. A Chinese Kaiserreich. <gasps> German China. Do we get a... Uh, like, oh, we don't get any new focuses. That That's fine. Uh, oh, we can attack some more people though. That's what I like to see. We can have the Dragon Throne. We can have ya Yuan. Gading shall be a fine representative for stewardess, stewardship. Rather. Pu Yai can be replaced for Ching. No, it's time for the Kaiser. A new face sits atop the dragon throne. Wilhelm, Wilhelm Hohen Zollerin has seized the mandate of heaven. Though still sitting his throne thousand miles away in Berlin, Kaiser Wilhelm has ascended into the role of Emperor of China. With the mandate of heaven. Oh, and f me sideways. 34.4 million on extensive conscription. Oh, damn, Transamur. You're going after Russia. I might join you, actually. I might take out Mongolia so we can actually get to Russia. Ah, uh, it's time to expand further. Easy. Easy. Give me all this land. I better be able to core this. Just notice, but we won't be building any military factories anytime soon. I need to build up some more civvies. We only apparently have 27. Come on, Tang. It's time for you to die, my friend. It appeared that Tang wasn't quite ready for this conflict. He is a little bit more prepared now in his defense, but we have managed to get to Kunming. Oh, that took longer than I expected. Tang held on for dear life, but there we go. Yeah, I'm sorry, Germany, but I'm not going to be helping you in this. Ju just just so you know, I'm, I'm not joining in. Well, that's the tree done. It, it's, it's finished. Um, I think all we're really going to do now is just declare war on people via justifications. Hello, Mongolia. Well, I managed to cut uh, Burma in half, however, yeah, we're we're short of everything, basically. We are now walking to victory. That's what we're doing here. We're walking to victory. Ah, uh, yes, the Burma divisions have been caught completely now. Yes, Burma died and it gave me a lot of guns. The Austrians have joined and they have intervened in the Second Weltkrieg. Haha, <laughs> Tibet. That's what you get for... Uh, me chaos. Sadly guys, the game keeps on crashing now. I, I honestly don't know why, because it's only 1941. Um, nothing out the ordinary is happening. What the f- um, We're still at war with Mongolia, and we're very close to capitulating them, although we are coming up against Russia's much better equipped divisions than us. Um, so sadly, kind of premature end into this. But at least we did form the Chinese Kaiserreich, which is what I was wanting to do. The focus tree stops when you form it anyways, so it's not like we're missing out on anything. So thank you very much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed, and I shall be back with... Oh, Germany's actually losing. Germany is actually losing. Great. Uh, yeah, I'll be back with something new very, very soon, and I think I know exactly who I will be playing as. I'm going to be doing Uniting the Cossacks. Hopefully. Fingers crossed, because I want to restore the monarchy. 
that way, which does sound interesting. And then this, the Smolensk, Smolensk conference. We might be able to actually get some land here peacefully from the Germans, which would be very cool to see. But anyways, until then guys, do take care. Cheer bye the now.